I'm Christopher Benjaminsson, CTO and co-founder of Fast Travel Games. And this is how we were able to adapt one of our award-winning VR games from this to this. Fast Travel Games is a VR-exclusive game developer studio located in Stockholm, Sweden. Our founders are industry veterans that have worked on some of the most popular games such as Battlefield, Mirror's Edge and Angry Birds 2. In 2018, we launched our award-winning game Apex Construct on PC and console. You are the last human alive and you have to use your wit and skills to fight robots that have taken over the world. VR really works because you're not just looking at pixels, you're actually there, experiencing an unlimited world. Normally, mobile VR has a lower fidelity. It really makes us developers limit how many objects you can interact with and how big the worlds can be. Last year, we asked ourselves, could we achieve console-like experiences on mobile VR? Not just for classic games, but for the newest creations like Apex Construct. The challenge when adapting a VR game to a standalone headset is the power and processing that is needed by VR is immense. Consoles and PCs normally have fans to cool the electronics, they draw power from the wall, and they have tons of physical space for powerful GPUs and CPUs. When we heard that ARM was working on optimizing the technology at the heart of standalone VR, we knew that this was going to be the future of Apex Construct and many other games. We reached out to them to see if they were interested in doing a project porting the Apex Construct experience to a mobile VR headset. More specifically, the Gear VR using a Samsung S8, taking advantage of the underlying ARM-powered hardware. And we were amazed. It's not just the processing power or the energy efficiency, it's really the entire ecosystem and the vast resources available that makes ARMS so powerful. With the learnings from this experiment, we were able to easily adapt Apex Construct directly to the Oculus Quest with minimal changes. A year later, we have become one of the lead developers for the Oculus Quest. Our team is really inspired and we are very excited about what the future holds. VR should be available anywhere, not just at home, tethered to a giant console or PC. For gamers, ARM has made it possible to expand the limits of our imaginations. <laughs>